All right guys, welcome back. So we're just about to play the seventh hole, par five, in our Golden Fairways match vlog. The score is currently one up to Dave, and I've just lost the sixth hole after spraying a tee shot out of bounds. Right, you can see those bunkers in the distance. They are in the middle of the fairway, so you can go right or left, don't go straight, which should benefit someone like me. Good shot. Good shot. At the bunkers, drawing off them nicely to hit the left hand side of the fairway. Perfect. We absolutely ripped it. Just drawing off the bunkers, similar line to mine. Right, so we have both absolutely crunched them. So, Hayley's. Uh, just in front of us there. I don't know if you can see, it's a little bit dewy. Yep, you can just about see that. And Big Dave is there. So I'm not gonna measure it out, but I'd like to say it's probably 25 yards. Yeah, I'm gonna go with 25 yards. So Haley's got roughly 250 in. And uh, struggling with the morning light. Can't see where she's going. Or she's just short, I'm not sure. But having said that, I can't see from here, so I'll let her off. Flag. So there's a very, very good reason why we can't see it, because someone's mowing the green and then put the flag back in. How kind. So Hayley's off in with three wood. She's going for it, she's going all out. She feels like she's got me on the ropes. So she's going to try and uh, put me under some pressure here. That is spanked. It's leaking though. Oh, it's a beauty. It's a beauty. It's just on the front edge. Maybe not quite on the green, but very, very close. Dave looks like he could be in trouble. The caddies are laughing at us for doing stupid commentating. Right, Haley, in her infinite wisdom, didn't push record. So the only thing you need to know about my four iron shot in was that it's gone in. It's albatross, okay? No, I actually hit it a bit slappy and I'm a little bit short, so just behind Haley's ball. Um, you didn't miss much, honestly. Oh, nice strike. Got to go a little bit. Nicely played. Caddy said birdie chance, that's good. Okay, so I've got a very similar shot to me, she's a little bit closer. Put the pressure on her though. Good shot. Good shot. Perfect length. Good, good. Good, good. Okay, If you don't understand why uh, that's funny, you should check out the first video. Are we picking up? Yeah. Oh, I don't know actually. No, we're not. Okay. Turns out Haley's got Haley's got to do some camera recording then. Hang on. Okay. Thank you. You'll get spiteful here. Well, it's a little bit further away than I thought it was. So I just tapped in for birdie. was a little bit further away than I thought, so we're not halsing. Okay. Just try it, just a little bit firm. Okay, back to level. Can't believe that. Cannot Adam and Eve that. She gave it to me as well, and then she took it away. Can you believe the sportsmanship of Hayley Wigmore? Everyone hit a thumbs down on this video, now. No, seriously, it was a good line. I just, I knew when I hit it, it was going out too hot. Freshly cut green. Can't quite get the pace of them this morning. So we are now playing quite a long 
par three. How far is it, Hells? On the marker? 190. And here we are, it's down there. So it's well guarded and uh, a good test, this one. Normally a long ironing. So Haley has informed me it's 184. That's what I think, it's 184. Um, she might be telling me fibs. So, Haley's going with a four iron. And uh, what's, your, what's your thought process here, House? Uh, it does play a bit longer, so. Fine. I think the draw a good shot. Yeah. But... Try and draw it in off that right hand side there. Aim at the open part of the green, draw it into the flag, and hopefully it goes in. It stayed there. It's safe. Just on the back edge. It's okay. Right, what bat are you going for? So I've got six iron. I just think it's a little bit downwind. So I think I better ride that a little bit. And uh, a little bit of a draw in from that right hand side and miss that bunker. That's the aim. Oh, it's a beauty. Be the club. Oh, a little bit big. Wow, that is massive. Massive. Right, so I haven't allowed for an awesome strike. I mean, I probably hit that the best I could. It felt like butter when it went off the face. Um, and that's big. Just a little bit left of the flag. So it drew a little bit more than I thought, but that's gone. That's, that's massive. So I think Haley's safe for the moment. I think Haley's looking in a better position than I am because there is a path and a little bit of shrubbery over the back. But when I say long, I mean it's that long. And then the next step is Bundai bush. So a little bit lucky. Good strike. Looks very, very good. Yeah, nice pace. I can have that. Isn't she kind? And you can see where she's looking. She is looking way out to her right there. So she's expecting a big, big movement. Between you and me, I think she might be over reading this. What do I know, eh? What do I know? What do I know? What do I know? Yeah, I think that's good. Yeah, okay. I'm not I'm not mean like you, you can have that. Alright, got a beautiful hole here. Uh, leading back to the clubhouse at night. So it's a long par for uh, water hole down the left, that's coming to play with your second shot. Bunkers down the right hand side. Beauty. So I hit mine a little bit high. I don't think it's going to be particularly long, but at least mine's nice and safe. It's uh, this par four. It does play a long way. Goes it another snorter. Just drawing round. Should hang on. Yeah, that's, that's a really good drive. You can see all that aqua. And the pin is on the left hand side, so it is, you do have to go over it. And the pin is in line with that bunker you can see on the left there, so you've got to cover it. Luckily we haven't got as far in as we thought, or what, as we normally have. I've got 150 to the centre of the green, as you can see by that yardage post. How far you got, Hales? Got 194, touch of breeze, she believes. Four iron. So we can do a safer option here. Yes, good shot. It's turning around that bunker nicely. Oh, it looks good. 
It looks good. Oh, it's just some absolutely foul bounces there. Must have just caught a down slope and it's just bounced all the way through the back of the green. Nobody likes to see that. Pretty nice shot, just stayed out to the right a little. Coming around a little bit off the slope. And that's long as well. A bit clean. Um, not much turf taken there. I think that's big as well. One thing we've seen over this front nine, the greens are really firm. Uh, not really taking much of a pitch mark, which is very surprising, bearing in mind the fairways are so sodden. Um, the, the greens aren't holding anything at the moment. So I have to take that into consideration over the next few shots. So this is the reason why both of us have shot through the back, okay? So as you can see from Haley, she's gonna walk down this slope. And look how short she gets all of a sudden. It's steep, so that's the reason why. So Haley's got a little bit of fringe grass to contend with, but then it's all pretty much downhill from there. So it's gonna require the softest of touches. Like that. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. I'll make her see it though, it's got a bit of a slope in that one. Pretty good pace. No halves here. Haley's called for it, I said no. But unfortunately, I don't know why, because I think I've got the more tricky putts. <laughs> we'll uh, see how it goes. Yep. Yep. Up. Up. Okay. So nine holes down and oh cool, blimey. How's right. women drivers, eh? Right. Um <laughs> quite short par for this one. Normally aiming for the front as you can see on the left. Yeah, anyway, just a little bit right of those is fine. That'll leave you with a short iron in. A bit left, to strike. That's okay, it's safe. But she's made it considerably longer than it was. Oh, it's a snorter. That's going to leave a short club in. Right, so Haley's got miles in. Um, not even in the same postcode as me, but. Yeah, I'd imagine she's got probably 145, 150 to the flag. Um, quite slopey over that area in the rough, so I don't quite know what a good result for her is going to be, I think, on the, on the putting surface. And on the correct tier is a good shot from here. Didn't see it. Unfortunately, the worst cameraman in the world has missed that. Oh my god, that's so bad. Yeah, so that's um, not gone well. Ball was quite above my feet. I thought it was going to swing quite a long way off the left there, but just stayed out right. And I've been informed that's where Haiti is as well. Not very good from 130 yards. So yeah, we've uh, both embarrassed ourselves a little bit here and uh, that's me even further right so not good with the gap wedge. Wee bit thin but pretty good from there. I'll take it. The strike. The par. No spin. No spin. See, we've got a guy following right up our chuff here, so we need to let him through. We've already let one through today, so this is where the one balls and the speed golf kick in. It's 
good part. Okay, pick it up. Up, knock something down. Right, so this uh, this guy in front, uh, we've just well, we've we just let through. Um, he had played up just short of the bunker uh, for his second shot, and in the time we fi finished our parts, he'd already finished the hole before I even sat back in the buggy. So this guy's on a mission, and I've just overheard his caddy saying to our caddies that she's very tired because she's having to run around this golf course trying to uh, keep up with him. <laughs> Pretty nice shot there, just drawing round off the right side. Long par five here, so pins at the back as well. I don't think it's going to be reachable today. Well, that's a challenge if ever I've heard one. So I'm going to be doing, trying, doing my best to try and get on here in two. Very good shot, straight down the middle. So Haley's outdriven me, but for a very good reason. Plug. Oh, it's absolutely crunched. Hang on, just fading a little too much. Uh, might be green side track. Nice strike there. Leaking towards the uh, bunker as well. Good shot. Uh, maybe bunker. Kelly doesn't think so, but I think so. So Raikkonen going through the left-hander. Raikkonen, wasn't it? Doesn't matter. So I think we're both in the front bunker. Uh, I know Dave said I was the bunker queen earlier, but in China they do have a ridiculous amount of sand in the, in the bunkers, so. A little bit hit or miss and pretty tricky to get the strike out. But, getting our excuses uh, in early. Yeah, getting my excuses in early. But um, it's quite a nice distance, so we'll see how it goes. Oh, bunker queen, under pressure. Yeah, see a good shot there, though. Must win him. Okay. Oh. Not a good putt by me there. Um, again, still not fully hitting them properly. Bunker shot was kind of strange. It was fat but thin at the same time, so it went out really hot and ran miles away. I don't claim to be the bunker king. I'll be honest. Who's got this to save her par? Good looking putt, good looking putt. Yeah. Oh, she's got it. And the fist bump as well, lovely. Yep, nice roll. I'm really happy with my. Uh, Closing out putts, to be honest, today. I mean, there was a, a couple of short misses, but in general, you know, my like long putts have been terrible, but I managed to sort of sneak them back in. So, quite happy with that. Managed to sneak away with a half there. Uh, I think uh, Haley feels better about a half than me. So, uh, on to the next. Nice try, just left it out a little bit. I think the club's right. Yeah, felt like I was aiming left there. He's just told me I was aiming middle of the green, which is where I wanted to go, but it felt left to me, and I've just left it out to the right. So. 
Yeah, he's going with four iron. Just going to try and put the pressure on. It's just turning over. Doesn't sound best. It's a good club. It's just turned over a little bit. It's got easier chip than me though. Good length. Interesting strike. Hmm. Not too bad. Yeah, odd strike, but downhill left or right, huh? I'm not left myself an easy one again. He's got a slightly more straightforward chip. As long as it goes past the hole, she's got an easier putt too. Not that far past though. Far putt. Sure. It's running a lot further than I thought, but it's run out of steam. Oof, unlucky. Good try. Let me off the hook. It's not quite sure if you can see it in the background, but the really tall building there. And that is what's locally known as the biggest <laughs> in Heiko. I'll let you determine why. Just try it, that'd be fine. Yeah. yeah, it's drawing back nicely. It's going to finish in perfect line. Beautiful. Yeah, unfortunately Dave's got a muddy ball. But it's not too far from the pin, so hopefully you can get it close. I me. And about driven him, by the way. Right, you've about that already. <laughs> Off camera. Oh, it's gone very high. Good length though. Pretty good from there. Just behind the pin. Yeah, stayed mine pretty well. I tried to get as high as I could so it lands soft. Sharp downhill from what the angle I was coming in. Uh, straight up in the sun and all I can see is spots now so the uh, camera angle is a bit on the wonk, you know why. So, only about 50 yards. It's hot, it's hot. A little bit of check on it. Too far again. Okay, but I, think it's, I think it's just my own. It's a good line. Has it got enough legs? Oh. No, she didn't. So that's the end of part two, guys. So wait until Thursday and part three will be coming out. Uh, thank you for watching the video. Uh, if you like the video, please hit like and subscribe to my channel and follow me on all my other social media platforms. Thanks very much. And I'm one up. It's very tight.